and I feel like I'm new at Misclicks <laughs> D&D season episode premiere demigod thematic with Argos strong masculine shield sword guy with <laughs> Adea the princess I don't know how to describe <laughs> yourself <laughs> the Disney princess <laughs> and Emma the corpse bride <laughs> <laughs> Neil, your turn. Back to you. And Neil, the DM. The awesome DM. He's always Neil. He doesn't change. It's always the same character. <laughs> what? I have a thousand characters. He's I control everything. All characters. When do I introduce to you the Neil from my backstory? This time it's not Pimper Neil, but. Oh, shit. There's a Neil in your backstory. Oh, there is? <laughs> That's so great. It's a derivate stuff in you. That's funny. <sighs> okay, so you guys have arrived in Brooksong. What would you like to do? I start singing a song about Brooksong. Playing off that it's a song. Song about a brook. It's a brook song. I look for any citizen. You find a citizen. Oh, hello, citizen. <laughs> Hello, good. Hello, good sir. How uh, may I help you? Do you guys have a tavern here? No, but of Argus? course. Uh, uh, no, Argus. No, uh, no. Uh, this, is Wait, this is like the by, most important. This is the most he important. In. Uh, in. Is there a problem, ladies? Uh, Argus just gets confused Shh. sometimes. Hi, I'm Adia. Nice to meet you. <laughs> and I'm Emma. Nice to meet you. And we're like shoving Arcus <laughs> behind us like this. Nice, nice. As I walk away to another citizen. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, what do you do now? Um, let's. I try to drag Arcus away to not go to a tavern. Okay. But guys, girls, sisters, sisters, I'm way better when I have some some bruise in me. It's like it's like it's. It makes me like. Oh, that's how it makes me. I need the beer. <laughs> you need the beer. Well, but are you it telling is me said... you're an alcoholic? Well. Maybe. Are you telling it... me you know you're an alcoholic and you're fine with it? Why not? The first Arcus. step to admittance, to resolving the issue, is to admit it. Yes. Arcus, as it is said, if you need beer, beer does not need you. <laughs> like, I'm still thinking about this. <laughs> Come on, let's go look for the egg. Let's ask around. Okay, fine. We can go to the tavern. You can have one beer. Yes. One. One. Yes! One. I start running. But, but, Too but. late. I'm already gone. Ugh. I run <laughs> after him. He's just taking off. God damn it. <laughs> you need your running. horse after him. Your horse is after him, uh, and find him walking into the uh, the red mailbox. Yes, Arcus. I open the door like this. Beer, you have to ask someone if they've seen the golden egg. Golden egg, got it. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, one beer, sir. Wait a minute, I'm broke. And then I go back to the girls, <laughs> sisters. <laughs> This pair of shades. They don't know me here. They don't know how amazing I am. <laughs> they don't know that yet. We need to spare some cheese. Can someone please make a gif of Stephanie going, Amazing I <laughs> am. <laughs> oh. uh, Arcus, I will buy you one beer if you bring me two pieces of information about the location of the golden egg. Two pieces. Got it. Give me the money first. Nope. I, I can't do it. <laughs> then I guess you don't want beer. I, I, I leave them and I start asking, I try to find some, some person to talk to at the bar. I follow her. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I sit down and I order a beer and I like caress it and look at Arcus and I'm like, mm, 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 beer. Mm. While they're doing that, <laughs> I look for a pretty girl in the room. Um, you see your sisters. 
<laughs> <laughs> I'm disappointed. I shake my hand. My head. Why do you guys have to be so hot? You're ruining my mojo. <laughs> you keep looking around because um, it's only afternoon. It's not that late in the evening. Uh, and you see another girl who's not quite as pretty as your sisters, but you know you see another one, and you're like, oh, okay, there oh, we go. Maybe her. And I get kind of yeah. close. And I just like, is she sitting over by herself? Uh, she is currently sitting by herself. Oh, that's weird. I sit down and like, hmm. Next to her. A, yeah. What's a pretty lady doing uh, in the afternoon all by herself at a bar, my friend? My <laughs> <laughs> I'm waiting for my brother. Your brother. Interesting. How, how's your brother? Is he like, tall and muscular like me? <laughs> 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 what did she say? <laughs> oh, you rolled? Not, not quite as tall and handsome as you. Ah! Ooh, and then I, I'm like, oh, and I'm satisfied. Um, I wish my <laughs> fine lady I could buy you a beer. Unfortunately, I just got to town and I got all my gear stolen. And yeah. You must not be that strong then. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I was sleeping, those sneaky bastards. But, um, so I can see that you're having a beer, right? <laughs> I'm having some wine. Some wine? Oh, you're a fine lady. Oh, you want to look at <laughs> My sisters are right over there. I'm sure, uh, I'm sure they would share a drink with us, right? Sisters, sisters, come here. And I move. I come, I come over with my beer. Uh, so what's your name? I'm, I'm my name? Yeah. My name's Jezebel. Jezebel. Is that how you pronounce it? Jezebel? Jezebel! Ladies, this is Jezebel. Hi, nice Jezebel. to meet you, Jezebel. I'm quite satisfied that she's not as pretty as me. Like, yes. <laughs> this is just a pretty war, right? <laughs> 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 so, um, we're here on a on a task, and then I look at the idea, and I'm like, so you want two information, right? Two information. So uh, we're here. Uh, do you know? Do you know anything about a lake around your city? Well, there's the lake to the north, Thornton's Lake. Okay. Um. So, one. That's one information. And I point at you. No, I already knew about the lake. There's Shit. also Hammer Lake to the northeast. <laughs> See, there's two lake. Um. So I pull out. I show her a map that I have in my pocket of. The <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay, so we heard about a, uh, there was, there could, might be something in the water of one of those lakes. Jezebel? You mean like a fish? <laughs> um. Jezebel's not really smart. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're also being very vague. There's something in the water. And she's like, what do you mean? Like, but I guess, I don't know, is the, is the golden egg super, super mysterious? Or like I'm not mysterious, but like secret. Is it like a treasure you... that, or? I mean, it's a treasure that's been stolen multiple times. So how secret could it be? Okay, we heard the golden egg. If you've heard about it before, is in the legend of, of the golden egg. Yeah, exactly. Isabel looks like a troll <laughs> with that <laughs> voice. <laughs> well, I've heard of it. That's how the dwarves were created, right? Yeah, exactly. So, what about uh, it? Apparently, it's in one of these uh, these uh, lakes. Really? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of just want to stand up and leave. I'm standing, <laughs> I'm standing behind Jezebel as she's as um, Arcus is talking to her, and I have my beer, and I'm like, mm. Would your Would your brother know anything about this? Uh, I don't know. He's not much one for stories. He's just kind of a farmhand. Who should we ask in town about this? Actually, leave the table right now because I haven't sat, so I'm just like moving, yeah. <laughs> not saying anything, and just leaving to go off to talk to other people. I'm looking okay. around to find someone else. Who to could talk. we ask about this, lady? The golden egg. Mm-hmm. Well, just kind of scratches his head. Maybe the village elder. He's been around the longest. Oh, the elder. Perfect. I hear that and I come back <laughs> not saying anything. From behind her, behind Jezebel, I'm like, mm -hmm. yes, one. <laughs> like, yeah, he must be like 108, 120 years old. He's really old. Where he must we... know something about it. Where can, we... Where can we find him? 
Uh, he lives down at a little past center of town in the red building. He must not be a human. What is he? I, I walk. A human. I hand human uh, Arcus the beer that I was holding. Human. <laughs> this is quite intriguing. Does he have magical ability? <laughs> no, he's not a spellcaster. How the hell did he live for a hundred and twenty years? Neil, did people live that long back then? Do we know that? That's pretty old. That's unusually old for a human. Okay. Especially to still be in, like, functioning form. I'm very curious now. Let's go pay him a visit. Thank you, lady. Maybe later I can buy you some wine. That'd be great. I love nice. a strapped man with muscles that can buy me wine. <laughs> <laughs> And when, when she says that, I, 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 I wait. Nice roll. It's like, Kling, I love men. <laughs> my girlfriend's really in the room laughing at me for my interpretation <laughs> of a girl. Yeah, one of the best comments I've seen from chat tonight, someone just sent me, or Jen just put it in from Spoon Fairy. A girl playing a guy trying to get nasty with a girl played by a guy. <laughs> <laughs> it is true. It is pretty funny. Uh, yeah, so uh, did she notice my wink? want to make sure she um, <laughs> and I'm like yeah this thing? Yes! she gets it and catches it and then giggles ooh I'm satisfied we leave okay unless Jen's still talking to somebody or wants to no I came back when I heard the thing about the old elder I was like, okay ooh, never mind <laughs> <laughs> I like how you float around <laughs> it's kind of how I walk <laughs> Yeah, because you're like grave keeps, you're like floating around. Mm. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm quite light. You have a robe so we can't see your feet. So you're just... <laughs> <laughs> it looks floaty, but it actually not, it, it's not floaty. Like one of those aliens, uh, the Star Wars aliens, what are they called? Uh, the ones that clone, the cloners, the super tall ones. I'm going to, I hate myself for saying this on live stream and not remembering the name of them. The because... super tall cloning aliens from. From what? Uh, never mind. I'll think of it and I'll blurt it out later in the broadcast because I cannot have my Star Wars knowledge rep ruined that way. But anyway, demigods. All right. Let's go to the old man's place. Okay, old man's place. Uh, you walk down the road until you find a little, a little past the center of town, which has a nice big fountain in it, and a couple of shops circled around and a few other I mean, interesting no. things. Ah. Uh, okay. Sorry. Go on. Uh, when you come to the small red house just past the center of town. Hmm. Is that where they said they were? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Knock, knock, knock. Uh, you hear a, just a second, coming from inside. He does and knock. there's a slow kind of like clunk, 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 clunk. And then a, a man opens the door and he's, very old. He's hunched over. He's got a cane. You notice that his left leg is missing and in places like a wooden peg leg. Hmm. He goes, Hello? What are you doing here? I take a deep curtsy. Hello, good sir. I do whatever the etiquette to tells me to do with my elders. Because I have that proficiency, Neil. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder who else has an etiquette proficiency. Fine, I do a boat. <laughs> <laughs> really good. We were oh more man, this episode is just... we knew. So it's like screwing with Jen episode. <laughs> um, but Jen, you're in front of me, so you talk. All right. Hi. So we've heard that you know many things, being the village elder. Is that correct? I've been around a long time. Probably not as you there, myself, but. A very long time, nonetheless. Hmm. I say in ancient comment, very knowledgeable, I see. I don't know if he's going to pick up on it. Eh? What'd you say? Ah, uh, never mind. I thought I could use my ancient comment with you, but apparently you didn't learn it. It's okay. It's okay. Still very knowledgeable. Very happy to meet you, mister. So we've been around wondering if you'd have some information about a golden egg. The golden egg, you say? Yes. 
Ah, well. <laughs> what makes you interested in the golden egg? Don't look at me! Don't look at me! We are demigods. And... Yeah. And we heard from the village of Proc. Proc! Proc! Proc. <laughs> and the people of Proc are... Um, what's the word that I'm looking for? They are remiss. Because... The golden egg is a large part of their culture, and we promised them that for the sake of their well-being, we would search for and return the egg that originally, as you probably know, belonged to Nerul. Uh, Nerul. Ner we must return it to its rightful place. I see. I I'm like, yes. Mm. What was his reaction when I said we were demigods? He didn't seem phased by it. I was disappointed by that. Well, I heard that a little while ago, uh, Jimmy's dad, Mr. Thornton Fisher, saw something shining down in the river. Now, he tried to get it and tried to send little Jimmy after it, but Jimmy didn't make it all the way down to the what it was. He said it was egg-shaped and last I heard the golden egg was spotted out in Thornton's Lake by some fishermen, but the river you know, kind of, it would have to flow, roll up river, which is most unusual, but something golden and shiny down in the water that's egg-shaped could be the golden egg. Hmm. Where did you say exactly they saw it last? Out in the river by town. You'd have to talk to Jimmy's father. Why did you say it would have had to flow upriver? Well, the river heads into Thornton's Lake, not out of it. Mm, so it's going... You, you say that it's moving past Brooksong. As opposed to... I don't know. You're the one who said it was going upriver. I'm... I'm just saying the river flows into Thornton's Lake, not out of it. Yes. So if the river got here from Thornton's Lake, it had to go upriver. Ah. Uh, mighty peculiar egg. Right. Okay. Well, could you direct us in the uh, way of this Thornton Fisher? Mm, I don't know where he lives. Probably lives over there somewhere. He just is like gesturing off into the distance as if he doesn't care. Are you sure you don't know where he lives? <laughs> Are you trying to seduce a 120 year old? That was I'm a cute, pretty old. cute, helpful, pretty face. No, Pardon that was a seduce a face. Huh? He's a youngster. He's younger than me. <laughs> you no, know, uh, I've been around. <laughs> that what you say to him? No. You tell I him you've been around? No, I don't say that. I don't. I just asked him if he was sure he didn't know with, like, big cat, like, puppy eyes. Puppy eyes. I don't really know where he lives. There's a lot of people in town these days. You know, when I was a little boy, this town only had 2,000 people. No, I didn't know everyone, but I knew most of them. And he proceeds to, like, start in on this story. And after, like, 20 or 30 seconds, you realize that he's gone. Like, you guys aren't even there to him. His eyes have glossed over. He's, like, off in a tail somewhere. I'm uh, listening, like, actively listening like this. I'm looking around. I'm using a uh, toothpick. Hmm. Okay. A minute passes. Two minute passes. Three minutes pass. Four minutes pass. I sit I'm down. I'm sorry to interrupt you, good sir, but we really must find this fisherman guy. What? What fisherman? The guy that saw the egg. What egg? The golden egg. There's a golden egg! <laughs> <laughs> I, I reach up to his face, I like stroke his cheek a little, I'm like, You've been so helpful, thank you so much! May the blessings of each day fall gently upon the crown of your brow. And then I take a neat curtsy and then like waltz out. I do a weird curtsy and I walk out. Alright! <laughs> he kind of like waves his cane at you. 
Goodbye, ladies! Nice meeting you! He turns to look at you, um, Arcus, and goes, What are you standing about here, there? Go get after them! They're pretty! Oh, yeah, oh, you yeah. You really should not waste your time with old men! Oh, yeah, I was, like, falling asleep on my lap. Oh, yeah, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> get out. I'm like, <whistles> Girls! I'm coming! <laughs> you cat call at them? You cat call at your own sisters? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I turn around and I like, do like, <laughs> <laughs> I catch a glimpse and I'm like, <laughs> <laughs>